for settings themselves, you do have the concave and the drum. For the concave settings, here to set the concave, we have a number of ways that we can do it on these machines. One, we can actually set the, set the concave by using the armrest. The other one is using the actual SEBA screen itself by touching the actual concave. We can move it up or down. The other way is when we load a crop from the crop settings, the concave will be positioned to the correct place than what's been selected in there. So that bring the concave closer to the drum, we thresh more, bring it away, we thresh, thresh less, but we allow more crop into the actual concave itself. So this system does rely on more crop being in there to allow crop on crop threshing. When we come back, the fan speed itself, the same again for the fan speed as through the concave and the drum settings. These settings here are loaded through the SEBA screen when we load up the crop and also on the armrest and the SEBA screen. You can then fine tune your fan settings here. So with the sieves, both the top and the bottom sieve, it is possible to vary their opening from 0 to 20 mil. So the opening itself or how wide they actually open will depend entirely on the crop setting and also the crop that you have going through the machine. So if you open the top sieve too much, you could overload the bottom sieve. If you don't open the bottom sieve enough, you might have too much returns. So what we're looking for is a fine balance between the two, not too close so that we actually start losing material over the back of the combine and not too open so we actually overload the rest of the combine. You need to have the balance between the two. So on this machine, I have got the electric setup so that I can adjust the sieves from the cab, uh, both top and bottom. If you have got the manual one, then at the back here, there'll be a lever, one for the top and one for the bottom sieve. On top of the main sieve opening, this handle here and the one on the right hand side, we can open or close the rear of the sieve just to give us that extra little bit at the back of the sieve. 